So today we're making our little cheat mask. And you can make one too, and it's really easy to do. All you need is a paper plate, a ruler, a stick, a popsicle stick, I don't know, eat a popsicle <laughs> or something. But you also need some cotton balls. I'm sure your mom has some. Some tape and Elmer's glue. And if you need your mom or dad, we need some scissors too to make the little hole for the, our face to fit in. And then I have some markers just to decorate it, make it my own, and you could do it as well. So all you need to do is make a circle in the middle. So I poke a hole through and then cut a circle. It doesn't have to be perfect. Whatever, just enough for your face to fit in, you know? Yeah, my circle is not perfect, but don't throw this part away because we still need this to make our ears. And then, now we have to prepare our cotton balls. I like to push mine, like, separate them so that they look more fluffy. So I just rip them a little bit, just like that, just so that they look a little bit fluffier. It's pretty easy. You don't have to. If you have really fluffy cotton balls, you probably don't need to do this, but I like this. And then when you have all your cotton balls ready, Get your Elmer's glue and just squeeze it and make another circle around. And then with your finger, all you have to do is just spread it. Just go back and forth so that you get all of the, the plate. And that's where we're going to put all the cotton balls on. And then, I don't know, just wipe it somewhere. It works. <laughs> and then you take your cotton ball and just place it anywhere because there is no right way to do this. Just make sure you cover the plate. And just go all the way around. Get more fluffy. Get some more cotton balls if you wanted to. Okay, and that's the face. And now, with the little circle that we cut off already, we're just gonna trace some ears. They can be whatever shape you want. They can be like Shrek, they can be hearts, they can be little horns, it does not matter, just whatever you want. I'm just gonna do like a little bell, I guess. So I'm just gonna go like that. And then another one. Well, I guess it kinda looks more like a fish. <laughs> whatever works. And then you're gonna cut them. Just follow your lines. And if you need mom or dad, they can help you too, or a big brother or sister. It's one ear. Thank you. 
And then you don't need that. Now you can throw that away. And then before I put them on my little mask, I'm gonna color it, because why not? It's me. And God loves you just how you are too. So you can choose whatever color you want. I have special markers, but you can use whatever marker you want. And I'm gonna make mine blue. And then you're gonna try and figure out where you want to put them. You could put them really high up. You could put them right to the sides. You could put them facing down. Whatever type of ear you want. Doesn't matter. And then I'm gonna write a message. Because in John 20, 10 27, it says, My sheep listen to my voice. I know them and they follow me. So I did the same thing on this one where it says, Jesus speaks and I follow. But we can just change that over to God speaks. And I follow. Because Jesus is God and God is Jesus. So, same thing. <laughs> and then we're going to take some more of that glue. We're going to put it on the edge of wherever you want to put it. And then put that on there. And then to make sure that it stays on, put some more right on where the ear is connecting to the plate. And then put a cotton ball over it so that it hides the lines. And the same thing on this side. And then I'm going to take my ruler because I didn't eat a popsicle stick before I came here, so I didn't have one. But same difference. And then with our tape, I'm just going to tape it and make sure it stays on. So we don't want it to fall off. My ears are blue now. This one's just white, but you could do pink, you can do green, you can do whatever because it's yours. And yeah, here's your little sheep face mask.